everyone and welcome to my channel. I recently got the idea to make some Monster High trading cards. I actually started with Claudine as you can see here and today I just want to film a chatty little color with me session as I work on Draculaura. So before I really get into the video, today I'm using Bristol paper that I cut up into small rectangles to make little trading cards. And I'm coloring with the Uhuhu Duo, Duo brush markers. And I just did that Draculaura sketch off camera using a Fiber Castile Polychromos um, color pencil. So, like I said earlier, I recently got the idea to do like little Monster High trading cards. And I started with Claudine because I really like her design and I thought she was really cute. And I thought Draculaura just seemed like the next natural character to do next. Um, but I think I got this idea to do Monster High fan art because there's been like a serious revival of Monster High and Monster High discussions on social media recently. And I think it's because of the new movie, the new live action movie that's supposed to be coming out. Um, to be honest, I don't really have any strong opinions on that movie because I'm not super connected to the Monster High characters in the Monster High universe. Um, I don't feel like any super strong nostalgia to them, partially because my childhood toys were definitely brats in my scenes. Um, I was practically in high school when these dolls came out, but I knew of the Monster High girls because my sister really loved them. All of this to say, I think that Monster High is a super cute concept and I really think that their character designs are so pretty. I really appreciate how they look both super girly but also goth and punk with all their super colorful hair and clothes and I mean even Draculaura, the idea of a vegan vampire, I think it's just so funny and so cute and I honestly wish that I had these dolls when I was younger. And if I had to pick my top three Monster High characters, it would probably be Cleo Denial, Claudine, and then either Draculaura or Laguna. I'm not sure. I think that they're both really cute though. And then my next trading card I'm probably going to do in this little like trading card series is probably Frankie. So then I could have the iconic Monster High trio be complete. I only cut out six rectangles for the trading card so far and I already used three so I'm not sure which characters I'll do next because there's so many but comment down below if you have some suggestions of who you think should make the list. So the next topic I wanted to discuss in this little color with me video is making YouTube videos. This is the first voiceover I've done on my channel and honestly I was so scared to put my voice in the first few videos uh, but I wanted to actually push myself to get out of my com comfort zone um, in this third video. And might I say voiceovers are really hard. Like at first I was just going to narrate what I was doing or what I'm thinking as I'm drawing but then it was really hard to sync na the narration with the video and I kept having to redo it I was just getting super frustrated and so I thought okay let me just talk let me just say what comes to my mind as I watch the video and then that's how I'll do the voiceover but then when I tried to do that I was literally speechless like I had nothing to say and so Ultimately, I decided that I would just write a script and then just read the script over the video and then the script may have something or nothing to do with the video, but then at least I can kind of, you know, at least I have then I have something to say as, you know, as I'm drawing and you guys can kind of get to know me too, like, and not just that I'm this, you know, floating hand. I know I'm still super new to YouTube, so I know it will get better as time goes on. And I know that if you actually want to do something 
and it's something that you like really feel in your heart um you're gonna have to push through the awkward stages and really get out of your comfort zone to do it so yeah Now back to the drawing, I'm just adding this blue color to the back um, because I wanted all the Monster High trading cards to have the same background so they really looked like they were all in the same set. And I'm just adding little, the final little highlights to really make it pop with the white gel pen. Yeah, I thought this part was so satisfying and it took me, I was so slow with writing her name because I was so afraid that I was going to write it wrong, like I was going to misspell it and I think I almost did even doing it very slowly. And this is the final result. Here she is. I think she came out so cute and here she is with Claudine. They look so cute together. Thank you for watching this super chatty color with me video and I hope to see you in the next one.